Good morning, horsemen. Today is Friday, September 11th. It's National Make Your Bed Day and also National Day of Service and Remembrance for those who died this day in 2001. This is your brand new Horseman News crew. I am Sophia. And I am Violet. <clears throat> Even though it's remote learning for the first quarter of this year, we will be here every Friday with news and announcements. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. Leading the pledge today are your Horseman News crew's fifth graders. Today's flags are flying at half, sta fl half staff as a way to remember those who died and served our country on September 11th in 2001. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Here are today's announcements. Today we remember the 19th anniversary of the attack of September of the attacks of September 11, 2001. It's important for us to remember that as terrible that day was, it brought America together, and it reminded us that we are all one people. Today we remember and honor everyone who died or helped 18 years ago today. It is also National Day of Service. All over America today, there will be projects like food drives and neighborhood cleanups. As a reminder that we can be for that we can be forced for good in our world. What will you do to volunteer today? And speaking of a force for good in our world, first grader Miles remembers us this week that the person our school is named after is is a man named Horace Mann. He was defendantly a De definitely a force for good. The public in, schools in public schools. For public schools. Did you know that he considers the father of public school education? Horace Mann started started libraries and teachers training schools and made schools better for all students. In his home state of Massachusetts, he's the United States and all the over the world is pretty cool. It's it's pretty cool that our school is named after him. And now an announcement from our very own Lunch Moms. Okay. Do you need brain food for your schoolwork? Are you feeling a little sluggish in the middle of the day? Come visit us at Horace Mann, your favorite Lunch Moms. Breakfast is from 8.30 to 9. Lunch? is from 11 to 1.15, and you can save yourself a trip by picking your breakfast up at the same time for the next morning. And remember to recycle. Come visit us at Horace Mann, and don't forget your face masks. Bye. Bye. Speaking of brain food that you can pick up at school, did you know you can order books from the Horace Mann Library and pick them up curbside by the gym doors, just email, fill out the online form, or call Miss Morris. Your books will be ready for curbside pickup every Wednesday from 10 until 12.30. Let's catch up on Horseman birthdays. Today we wish a very happy birthday to Amos... Amos? Amos? Amos... D'Agostino. D'Agostino. And Roscoe? And Roscoe... Escra. Escra. Over the weekend, Josie Duffy and Valerie Lewis will celebrate birthdays, and Thursday is the birthday of Will Crawford. Last week's birthday kids were Abby Mohammed, Lorenzo Tadic, and Marlena Piazza. Piazza, and Noah Vanderberg. Happy early September birthday, everyone. And now here's our first grader, Isabel, with brand new joke of the day, followed by Violet with weather and sports. Isabel's joke of the day. Hi, I'm Isabel. This is my joke of the day. Why did the teddy bear say no to dessert? I don't know. Because he was stuffed. <laughs> That's my joke of the day. See you next time. Bye. Thanks, Isabel. In weather news, temperatures will stay around 90 degrees this weekend. 
Each, 80, 80, 80 degrees this weekend. Each day will be partly crowd, cloudy. The greatest chance of rain is on Sunday with a 60% chance. In sports news, here is how the pandemic has most affected the Browns. Br many Browns players decided not to play because of the p pandemic, including tackles and guards, but they have two new tackles and a new tight end. Quarterback May Baker Mayfield will be playing for a new head coach. They will be playing Baltimore Ravens on Sunday. The Cleveland Indians started their short season in July. This week they climbed to the top of their division with the help of good pitching from Shane Bieber. In Lakewood Sports News, soccer, cross country, and football teams are all practicing and competing this fall. The Rangers marching band played for the first time on Friday night. For now, For that's, now that's all, all I have to say, say so make, make it an awesome, awesome horseman day. day. The first, first broadcast, broadcast of the school year, year is brought to you by Violet and Sophia, the horseman lunch, lunch moms, moms, and our amazing joke, joke teller, Isabel. Have, have a fantastic, fantastic Friday, Friday, and remember, remember the five B's, B's of horseman. Be, be safe, be respectful, be kind, and be responsible. Be responsible. Be be safe, be, safe, be kind, be, kind, be respectful, be, be responsible, and be the best you can be. And don't forget to make your bed. The news is in and we're out.